What is up everyone, Kenny D here, and I just want to say thank you guys for sticking around for more videos for you for this for you guys out there. And today we're doing another Spin Master review on the World Finals 20 Avenger. And this paint scheme has to be one of my favorite paint schemes of Avenger of all time. And it's got the red, white, and blue paint scheme. Not gonna lie, I gotta love this design of Avenger. Not to be joking, you can tell of the headlights. It looks just like the 1957 Chevy Bel Air. I mean, it looks really cool. I don't know why if they made this, but it looks so cool. But I like the way on the uh, I think it was it called I think it was called Slap and Stick. I have no idea what that is, but maybe that's gonna be the case. There's the one that says Steps Tow Service. Or does it say? Oh yeah, Steps Towing and Heavy Transport. You see the Florida right there. There it is, there's the flame decal, look at, look at that. It's got like, it reminds me of the dual side Avenger. The one with the orange and one in the green. It's kind of cool. Although, um, the one thing I really most about was this. The Wolf Files 10 Avenger that I never get in the 2010 toy line. Yep, there he is. I mean, it looks really cool though. It's got the aqua blue paint scheme. And I got so many Wolf Files Avenger paint schemes, and one was the original. But I'm not going to do a review on those guys, because Hot Wheels it, Hot Wheels end the contract for Monster Jam. So, that's going to be it for you guys. I mean, check this guy out. And I'm not even joking, this guy looks amazing. I mean, this has to be one of my favorite ones of all time. It's got some blue rims. And the BKT tire printing, just like they did with Max D, El Toloco Yellow, and I think Wolf Files 19 event, 20 Avenger himself. I believe there's so many of them, if I can't name a few. There it is. So well. In my opinion, though, it looks so good. I mean, I've seen this event two times, or I've seen this truck two times, but without the Steps Tow Service logo. I mean... Well, actually, one in Wolf House 19, or Wolf House 20, this one has this. But in the Orlando 2021, they removed the steps and toast service logo, and now they moved it into Global, which is a new brand for Avenger. Or new sponsor brand for Avenger. I mean, in my opinion, I really liked it. I know, I know many people spoiled this Avenger potty bait scheme. I know they did. So, don't ask questions for this. I mean, it's it's cool and all, but not for the best. I mean, even though I already unboxed the Roll Files 19 Avenger, if you guys wanted me to go check it out, or if you guys want to go check it out. I mean, it's got the stars and stripes. It's like the red, white, and blue paint scheme. They should have bring this back. Well, they did it during Indianapolis, but they never did it in San Antonio, so... Avenger is only a one blank slate, since all they have is the green World green Avenger, like this one right there. If you can see it, that's the World that's the original Avenger that they used during the events. So, unfortunately, we don't get to see the World Finals Nine Twenty Avenger at any time. So, so that I think his last appearance was at Indianapolis, Indiana. So, it's a shame we don't get to see it. But hopefully, I did today. And, yeah, also on August 7th, which is next month, I'm going to a Monster Jam event in Sunrise, which is awesome. If you guys want me to see me do a video on it, you guys let me know. Or if you guys want me to do a highlights on it, just leave a comment. So, so tomorrow we'll be going to Universal Studios Florida, which is going to be good. Also, because I can't wait to see all the, all the characters are reunited together. But this is the first time I reunited with that park since way back in, was it 2011 or 10? I think it was in 2011 when I was a kid, since I went to Universal Studios for the first time. It's, it's just crazy. I get a little bit scared because I want to go some rides, but I did. So I did now today, but I didn't. So, well, I went to Universal Studios once when I was a kid, but it, it changed a lot. So... I'll be doing vlog videos like this one if if you guys are showing the video for you guys. 
But also, the Kenneth McCumber vlogs is no more since I, I rebranded re it as Kenny's Adventures, which is the name I give. So if you guys want to go check out my new new username, Kenny's Adventures, go ahead and go check it out. It's really good. I'll post some videos on that one on my vlog channel on th rather than on this one that you guys are watching. I mean, uh, it's for, for the best. So anyway, no time for like chit chatting. Let's just get to the review on the World Files 19 Adventure. We got like five minutes in the video, and it's just dumb. Anyway, here's the truck. Like it, here it is. It's got the silver chassis and the black rims. It looks so well. And it's got the sweet, beautiful headlights. I mean, I don't like though. It's it's a really cool casting. They should have done this on the world F on the Avenger body, but all they got is a pickup. So I believe that's all they have. So yeah, it's not my biggest fan though. And they re-released it on the Retro Rebels, which is pretty sad though. I'm not I'm not even happy for for uh, Spin Master because. They use the pickup Avenger in, rather than the 1957 Chevy Bel Air. So, hey, at least um, they released it in last year's Mix 15 assortment. So I'm happy. So unfortunately, we didn't get to see the wristband that we get, that, that comes with the Avenger body. So, yeah. Anyway, guys, that is it. That might be the World Files 20 Avenger for the Spin Master review. And so if you want to go subscribe to my new username, Kenny's Adventures, go ahead and do that. So the link is down there in the description. If we go check out my newest, newest username, Kenny's Adventures, go ahead and be the best YouTuber out there in the world, like me, obviously, and not like you guys, uh, uh, only like you guys, obviously. <laughs> anyway, we'll see you guys later for the next video, and we'll see you guys tomorrow on the new on my vlog channel that is Kenny Kenny's Adventures. Bye bye, guys.